because the connection wasn't too clear in the pamphlet, just if you could clarify. Okay. Will you uh, condemn Hamas here and now? I'm sorry, what? Will you condemn Hamas? Would I condemn Hamas? As a terrorist or a genocide organization? Are you asking me to put myself on a cross? So you won't. I, I actually have had this experience many times. You didn't read the pamphlet because the pamphlet is chapter and verse. Uh, the main connection is that the MSA is part of the Muslim Brotherhood network as revealed in the documents. I don't think you understood what anyway, I meant by that. I is, meant if I say something, I'm sure that I will be arrested for reasons of Homeland Security. So if you could please just answer my question. If you condemn Hamas, Homeland Security will arrest you. If I support you. Hamas, because your question forces me to condemn Hamas, if I support Hamas, well, I look really bad. If you bad. don't condemn Hamas, obviously you support it. Case closed. <laughs> I have had this experience, uh, I give you, I had this experience at UC Santa Barbara where there were 50 members of the Muslim Students Association sitting right in the rows there. And throughout my hour talk, I kept asking them, will you condemn Hezbollah and Hamas? Uh, and none of them would. And then when the question period came, the president of the Muslim Students Association was the first person to ask questions. And I said, you know, before you start, will you condemn Hezbollah? And he said, well, that question is too complicated for a yes, no answer. So I said, okay, I'll put it to you this way. I'm a Jew. The head of Hezbollah has said that he hopes that we will gather in Israel so he doesn't have to hunt us down globally. For it or against it? For it. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you for coming and showing everybody what's, what's here.